Hi, I'm Ryan Baker, writer, director, and producer of the Love and Death Saga. And I'm Rena Martinez, lead singer of Pure Mutations. And we are Tim and Josephine. Hey! <laughs> that is amazing. Uh. We're going to be doing a, a line reading of some scenes from the Love and Death Saga. <gasps> but we only have one script. Oh. <laughs> Sharing is caring, Tim. <laughs> Sorry, Josephine. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Wouldn't that be wild, though? Like, if everyone thought I was playing Tim and you were playing Josephine, but, like, all, the day of the show, I go out in a wig. Dude, you wouldn't even need a wig, though. That's true. I could just, like, shave. Yeah. shave put on some lipstick. No, you don't even need to do that. Just, like, put on a dress and you're good. <laughs> <laughs> just keep the beard. <laughs> I have been told that's more romantic. Okay. Yeah. Tim and Josephine's first scene together, the reunion here. Um, so this is right after your song, actually. Oh. Give life one last try. <laughs> That's right. I'm like, hey, don't sell that on eBay to a fan, because I'm a famous book writer now, obviously. Mm -hmm. And uh, you decided to go and see if I am any better than the other guys. Oh. Oh, yeah. He rises alone now, takes a quiet look around. No, Joe, not yet. He's expecting you because your mom. Oh, yeah. He stands in front of his desk and collects some of his papers together, cleaning up. Joe approaches him from behind, holds out her hand. Hey, Tim, right? I'm. Tim turns around, stops her, smiles, shakes her hand firmly. Josephine, it's been a while. You look great. Dude, I look great? You've completely changed. No more bad head, right? <laughs> <laughs> Your mom, who now appears to be missing, uh, said that you were going to try college again next summer? Uh, not so sure about that one. Bad experience? Bad people. Right. You're still with, um, Theo, was it? Ah, uh, no. That ended a pretty long time ago. Yeah, I heard something about that. Then why'd you ask? Just being redundant, I guess. <laughs> Happens to the best of us. It's crazy that you're here, doing all this. It's been rocky, but uh, I'm a firm believer in the philosophy that everything happens for a reason. Hey, I think they're kicking me out of here soon, but uh, if you were willing, I'd love to grab coffee or something like that, play catch up. That'd be great. And Joe exits. Joe, how can it be? Whoa. Her mother Whoa. said she'd come here. Whoa. <laughs> Joe, how can it be? Her mother said she'd come here. But part of me didn't believe. That would be fucking funny if Joe stayed on the stage doing background vocals. <laughs> 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 this solemn soliloquy. <laughs> I want a lame Miz cut where the bishop redeems Valjean's soul and then stays on the stage doing riffs. Yes. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Two, four, six, oh, one. <laughs> 